Alexis Sunshine 83, it's always sunny here. Hey Sunshiners, Lexus Sunshine 83 here. Hello, hello, super sunny day, what is up? Today's video is going to be a thrift haul, but not just a normal thrift haul. It's going to be an online thrift haul with ThreadUp. I've partnered with them a bunch of times, which if you guys didn't know, ThreadUp is the world's largest online thrift store with brands up to 90% off, and they're offering you guys 30% off your first order. Just click the link right down below and use the code. I know a lot of you guys say that you don't have thrift stores or you don't have good thrift stores, so this is kind of like a great option for that. One of my favorite things is you actually can search for a certain like item or brand. So I actually taped in Harley Davidson and there may be a Harley Davidson top in this haul and I'm just so excited. I a lot of times would see other people's videos being like, it's all like girly stuff. And I didn't know how to like work the website to find exactly what my style is, but I think I've cracked it. Yeah, I definitely, okay. Yeah, I definitely think, um, I cracked it. And I know for myself, like I used to be like a online shopper at it. That like feeling of buying stuff online. I don't know. I'm like, I want to buy secondhand. I also want to do it in my pajamas, you know? <laughs> Let's dive into this. There's a lot of denim. There actually is a lot of denim. I'm most excited about these. Obviously thrifting jeans is hard enough, but thrifting online jeans is like, eh. And I've definitely done it in the past and have failed in the past. But I know, especially from this company, which is by BDG, which is by Urban Outfitters, I'm usually like a 26 so these were actually a 27 and I was like okay if they're like a little bit loose that's okay and I'm so glad they were a 27 because they fit so good they are the mom high rise slim and come on like these are so cute they have little flowers on them which I think is just so adorable and they fit amazing the estimated original price was $48.99 and I got it for $20 I believe all of these items are under $20 but they honestly are in amazing condition I am so excited I would love to just pair it with maybe just a white crop top just because they do have the flowers on them so I don't really think putting them with a graphic Harley Davidson shirt would be like the best thing and they crop really perfectly as well they aren't a thick material they actually are a little bit thinner but they're still jean they're not that like jaggy material so this one has to be my favorite find because I was so excited when I bought it and I was like please please fit and they do. Coming up with another pair of jeans that actually do fit. I made sure that I like tried them on before I showed them because I was like, man, that would suck. Like half my haul doesn't fit. These ones are originally from Pull and Bear, which I've never tried before. So I was kind of like feeling a little risky since I have no idea what actual size I am in their jeans. Their sizes must be a little bit like off because it does say that it is made in Turkey. Um, so it says a 38 and E U R. The estimated original price was $71 and I got them for $19.99. And again, they are jeans, which like obviously I have a lot, but they have a little, like a little added feature. I love this rainbow print. They fit so good. And I don't know how, I don't know how this happened that I got so lucky. These ones are kind of the same material. Like they're very light, kind of thin, but they still are jean material. They are not the jaggy material. Okay, I have a couple more denim pieces, but I'm gonna like, pause on that since I just showed you two other denim pieces. This I am so excited. So if you didn't know, I'm like a hardcore NSYNC fan. I still know every single word to every single song. My favorite definitely has to be tearing up my heart that like will forever be my favorite song. Very surprised to actually see this on thread up. Like I went and searched it just as like, maybe they'll have it. Maybe they won't. So I, I typed in NSYNC and this shirt came up. In sync shirts on Depop are like possibly $30 to $50 depending on the fit and the style. And these, they're originally from In Sync. Like they aren't like Hanes with like just the pattern like printed on, you know what I mean? I don't know, maybe these are actually at Target because I, mm, I don't know. Anyway, it doesn't matter. The estimated retail price for this was $18 and I got it for $8, which I think is pretty perfect. I think that's the least expensive item that I ended up getting. I was just really excited because it is so me, and if I was at a thrift store, I would totally thrift this. It is in a small, which I definitely would have preferred possibly like a medium, if not a large, but that's okay. I will still rock it. I don't even care. Then I got this originally from Forever 21. It is in a small. The estimated retail price was $16. And I got it for $7.99. Oh, I guess this is the least expensive one. And although it is a long sleeve and we are in summer, I get it. Like it's literally almost 80 right now. It's okay. I'm still gonna rock it because again, air conditioning, it's so light. It is really light and it just has little buttons on the front and that with some high-waisted jeans with just these, that's a cute look. It looks like a child shirt right now. It does stretch. I mean, I'm assuming it stretches. Hopefully it stretches. This one is originally from Zara. The estimated retail price was $45 and I ended up getting it for $17.99. And it's just this like, I don't even know what to call it, but you know, you've seen this type of shirt 
all around. I've been trying to thrift shirts like this and it's so difficult. It's more of a cream, which I'm not in love with the color cream, but I think it is really cute and the fact that I really like the like square neck thing and then it has these like flowy sleeves, some buttons, and it's kind of lined. I think these with shorts would be really cute. The only thing is I don't know if it looks good with my hair. Hmm. We have another item from Zara, which only reminds me of a picnic blanket. This one is in a small and the estimated retail price was $48 and I got it for $20. And it just looks like this. Look at how cute it looks though. This is very girly. I don't know what I think about it. This one definitely reminds me of summer. I really like that it has elastic right there. So with my high waist the jeans like I don't really have to like tuck it in too much because it also I mean it is kind of more of a crop top and then it has these little bows on the side like look at how cute that is so I ended up actually getting two different dresses this is the first one it must have been like a collaboration with mink pink by urban outfitters is in a medium and the estimated original price was $71 and I got it for $20.99 and it just looks like this and again it kind of has that like puffer sleeve thing and I just I really like the silhouette of it again I don't really wear dresses but I'm going to try okay it would even be good just as like a crop top love kind of like that detailing and is it blue yeah it's a white and blue I think the biggest issue with me not wearing dresses is I never thought of wearing my like bike shorts under dresses I never thought of that so and somebody I think commented that and I was like Oh, that makes sense. So hopefully I will try and rock this. The next dress is originally from Lulu's and it is in a medium. The estimated original price was $60 and I got it for $17.99. Again, it reminds me of like a picnic blanket, just a dress like this. And I just think it is so cute. The material is super, super light. It's not see-through, which is even better. I really like the back. It kind of has like some ties on there. Again, I am going to try to wear dresses. I promise. And I think with my hair, it actually looks kind of cute. I found a denim jacket, which is so awesome. It's originally from Forever 21. The estimated original price was $30 and I got it for $13.99. And it just looks like this it's in a zero X because it is from the plus size section. So it's like an extra large. The only thing that I didn't realize is the material is really thin and all my denim jackets are like quite thick. So maybe it's actually going to work better since it's summer and I probably shouldn't be wearing thick denim jackets all the time. The only thing is it definitely does not feel like an extra large. It more feels like a large. It even feels not tight on me, but just like not what I would think like a traditional than like extra large would feel like on me, if that makes sense. But uh, overall i so like it i saved the best for last because i was so excited about this item like i said i searched harley davidson on thread up to like see what would come up and i found a harley davidson tank top and not just like a harley davidson like woman tank top just because i don't think they have any guys sections there so i knew it was going to be like that more like fitted look but it has flames on it which usually like the women's harley davidson shirts are like bedazzled or like pink or something but this is so my style it is in a medium which it doesn't really feel like a medium it's a little bit like looser which i'm actually really happy about the estimated original price was 71 dollars, and i got it for 22 dollars and 99 cents sorry the lighting is super wacky I really really like this and this oh I'm just so excited and yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this thrift haul and I hope it also showed you that you can find trendy pieces secondhand going into the mall and seeing like all these clothes that I'm like man that's really cute I really want it and then going to the thrift store sometimes I don't really find the most trendiest pieces it's definitely possible obviously you can totally see those in my videos but i know for a lot of people it's a little bit harder so hopefully this is kind of like another alternative and inspires you to find different avenues to buy second hand and again if you guys would like 30 percent off your first order with thread up definitely check out the link right down below and use my code for that and don't forget to subscribe right down below and hit that little bell to be notified every time i make a new video make sure you're following me on instagram and twitter alex and 83 and i will see you guys on sunday with a brand new sunny sunday video enjoy Enjoy life, be happy, and I love you lots. Bye!